Hey, we're watching the Black Panther trailer. We're excited for it. It's, it's been viewed a lot, but uh, like it played during the NBA finals and people lost their shit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think it's really brave of Marvel to hold on to the title Black Panther because did you know that the character Black Panther was made before the actual Black Panthers? Mm -hmm. And there was a lot of like, uh, <laughs> I know they had a dip in their, like, their comic sales like back in the day. I know. People were like, Bleh. They could have changed it to, I don't know, like the dark cat. What do you know about Wakanda? It's a third world country. Textiles, shepherds, cool outfits, all the front. My first reaction was like, oh cool, like there's uh, the white dude explaining Africa. Like, oh, for the first like 20 yeah. seconds. Yeah. Well but the main weird. bad guy is white, so they nailed that part. Okay. <laughs> uh, right. Uh, and then you have, uh, what's his name, Martin, is it? What, what? Martin Freeman. Martin, Martin Freeman. Mm -hmm. He's in a suit, he's looking frumpy, yeah. just how I like him. Yeah. And he's <laughs> nice like, and frumpy. Yeah, Africa, you know what I mean? It's like third world country, mm -hmm. kind of, third world country, uh, cool outfits. Cool outfits, yeah. <laughs> as everybody yeah. knows. Yeah, exactly. Uh, and then knows that. they explain Wakanda as being like, of like the lost city of El Dorado, and it's like, mm -hmm. oh, it's not in South America, it's in Africa, and I'm like, I could have told you that. <laughs> It was. It was like, it was like, uh, like, like Mansa Musa was supposed to be like he was like the richest dude in, mm -hmm. in like medieval times, and so like he had so much gold that it, it, he was like the the legend of El Dorado. So like it really was in Africa. So in this cliff part, do people like live? In the cliff, is it yeah, like Yeah, this is Adobe? dangerous. There's no railing it's on these dangerous. cliffs. Yeah, are people just coming? Like, do they live in that cliff? It's nice that like. For like hundreds of years, this technologically advanced society hasn't like leaked to society at all. It's just like snitches get stitches like originated from Wakanda. Yeah. Can we talk about this cast though? Oh yeah, mm -hmm. like I feel like this they they stack the cast and mm -hmm. the only they person did. that really is missing uh, is already like sort of in that universe, which is Sam Jackson. Morgan Freeman. Mm -hmm. Oh Morgan yeah. Fre Morgan. Yeah. Sam Jackson Freeman. actually wanted to be in this movie, and they yeah. were just like, no, too many black people. You gotta be. Oh, you, no. you, we gotta save you for Infinity War. It is funny how Force would has become like the old man that we go to. It's either Good. Forrest Whitaker or like Harrison Ford. Yeah. Like he, uh, Morgan Freeman advice. passed the mantle of old wise black actor down to Forrest Whitaker. And it's hard for a good man to be a king. One oh. of the other things that I noticed about like this movie that I'm also super excited about is um, Marvel like, kind of has like a, like a women problem, I think, in a lot of they their do. movies. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But like in this movie, he has a kick-ass all-female guard mm -hmm. right. um, that is like the only people protecting him. What's cool about like this whole series is that they really do like draw on like African mythology and like mm -hmm. history and stuff. And so with the female bodyguards, those soldiers, there's like sort of a history in Africa of like female soldiers. There's like mm -hmm. warrior queens. Cool. And so, yeah, a lot of like the, uh, the the outfits, like the wardrobe is like inspired by like actual sort of like cultural mm -hmm. outfits, which is dope. I can't wait to see uh, a bunch of white people cosplay this movie. Oh, no! <laughs> yeah. oh, I can't wait. It's gonna be real wait. fun. <laughs> I mean, if, if it's in the full like sort of Black Panther, like, like you couldn't tell. I really like this character's name is Shuri and uh, she is Black Panther's sister who in the comics mm -hmm. becomes a queen. Yes, queen. What? <laughs> uh, she's yes. got Panther uh, shooty orb Gloves. We have the studio gloves. That's, that's the official canon title. We don't know a mm -hmm. lot about the plot, um, but what they no, kind of don't. set up with the teaser is like that. You know, can you stay a good person while mm -hmm. like taking on the like this huge responsibility of you know stepping into the shoes of your father? It has the sort of superhero. Uh, element, but then also kind of like a Game of Thrones kind of situation. Like yeah. Michael, Michael B. Jordan and uh, right. his crew trying to take over, like it's cool. Mm -hmm. it's, really what it does, mm -hmm. I feel like it raises the stakes. Like it's not just, you know, some like Spider-Man kid trying mm -hmm. to be like, oh boy, I hope I make my Uncle Ben proud. Well, and if know, Uncle Ben was in this, <laughs> it would be a completely different <laughs> Yeah, character. this would be a completely different Uncle Ben. My favorite mm -hmm. part of the trailer was uh, when um, Andy Serkis was explaining Africa for 20 seconds, the first. Yeah. Wasn't that great? Uh, 20 seconds, yeah. I was like, yeah, uh, we gotta set up the whole this whole Africa. We gotta explain Africa. Listen, yeah. I'm not gonna act like I've been there. What was your favorite part? Uh, I liked when Michael B. Jordan put on uh, the mask uh, that my mom has in her living room. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and then broke into the Is FBI. that him in there? For me, the fight scenes look uh, amazing, and especially mm -hmm. when um, the Black Panther like jumps over the car. And, like, yeah, I love lands. that. It's yeah. like it's very like smooth and like mm -hmm. a cool fighting style. Also, like one of my favorite parts was uh, the dude like just 
with, sitting with his legs crossed with like that mm -hmm. African. Mm -hmm. That's the mm -hmm. one everyone's memeing. It looks so African. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And um, a lot of our like fantasy and just like a, like fiction period is based on a lot of like European uh, like yeah like throwback style, and it's nice to see like a very Africa based. Mm -hmm blockbuster movie. I think Wonder Woman and Black Panther is gonna change the game for superhero movies. Yeah, me too. Is. This is the very first um, Marvel movie that has uh, a lead that isn't a white guy. Mm -hmm. And that's crazy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's crazy! Yeah, I mean, it's yeah. like, it's cool to celebrate, celebrate that, but also you're like, really? Like, yeah. I know. you know what I mean? Hulk was half green. Hey, you like stand-up? Come see the Cracked Stand-Up Show. It's happening June 22nd at Meltdown Comics in Los Angeles. If you want to see amazing comics, including our own Josh Sargent, go to nerdmeltla.com slash tickets. And if you want to see me do a funny dance... Sorry, not today.